Chaos Group finally released the new version of V-Ray as an update. Let's get to know more about V-Ray 6 Update 2 and new features. Hello, welcome to MemViz. Redefining Connectivity Chaos Group Company has been looking for connecting applications for years and has paid attention to this in this update. From now on, you can easily bring Enscape data to V-Ray with the help of Enscape VR Scene Importer and spend your time being creative in designs and presenting them. With this export, you can easily use all V-Ray tools for presentation, like Camera, Chaos Cosmos, Chaos Scatter, Lighting with HDRI or V-Ray Sun and Sky, Environment Effects, Post Processing, be careful to have Enscape 3.5.6 and higher and use V-Ray 6 Update 2. Shaders can also be created and exported on any platform and rendered in V-Ray. This is done by MaterialX. Imagine being able to use any material in this way in V-Ray. Also, now V-Ray supports the latest version of 3D's Max so that you can use its capabilities, especially USD. You can easily import and export USD data with Material X. Better and faster workflows. With the help of improvements in the user interface and increasing the speed, it has become easier for us. With the help of Chaos Cloud, you can have a supercomputer at home and do other things besides rendering. From now on, you can access Chaos Cloud rendering with just one click and you don't need to leave 3ds Max or wait. Exporting files with a lot of data always took a long time. From now on, you can export at a higher speed. You can see that in the test, V-Ray 6.1 was exported with 8 minutes and 45 seconds and in V-Ray 6.2 with only 43 seconds. From now on, V-Ray Lister is very advanced and you can edit both lights and cameras in one list. Filters can also be created to make access easier. More powerful GPU rendering. From now on, V-Ray GPU allows us to do more things faster. N-Mesh can be used to create complex panels and fences and fabric on surfaces much faster. Also, animation rendering is four times faster so that more and more attractive outputs can be obtained. Enhanced control for even more realistic scattering. With the help of new Chaos Scatter tools, we get closer to more realistic scatters. These tools are created in the group's hierarchy, altitude, and look at sections, which are in the Nordic future. We will examine them. V-Ray Frame Buffer. Frame Buffer is always evolving. From now on, you can use the chromatic aberration effect and make the renderings closer to reality. In this video, we introduced V-Ray changes. Soon, we will examine them with more and more specialized workshops. Thanks for watching us. Support us with like, comment, and subscribe. Bye, until the next video.